All right, that part's simple enough, right? So then we close the top down. Now we get to the computer part of it. All right, when you first, um, when you first go and put your joint in, what you do is you go to my computer, right? You'll right click it. Hang on a second, I can barely see this. You right click it and you go to props, right? Properties, then you're gonna go to hardware. Go to hardware, and then you go to your device manager. Now that's one way to get to the device manager. I'll show you another way. A lot of you probably know this already, but this would be for the benefit of those that don't. The other way is you can go here and go to your control panel. And in control panel, I think it's system. Double click on that, you get to the same page, hardware, device manager. All right, boom. So when you go to device manager, you click on disk drives. Ha! What do you see? Two of them. Western Digital, Corvair, same serial number, everything. Now, how do you know which is which? Hmm, all right, that's an issue. Once again, you click on one, go to properties, right? All right, boom. This is how you know. Location. This one will say location zero, right? You can check the driver information. It's 5.1.25, whatever, whatever. Close that out. We go to this one right go to properties once again and look this one's location one so that's the only way you know one is location zero one is location one but as you see it's the same driver all the other stuff is identical right so that's all good so what that tells you is that windows knows you got two drives but what's going to happen is when you go to my computer all right once again I apologize because I did it already but when you go to my computer you're only gonna see the system drive you're not gonna see this extra drive and so if you don't see the drive how are you supposed to format the drive or partition it or name it or all that other stuff all right well I'm about to show you how to do that right now you go back to my computer right and right click but this time we're going to go manage, right? And we go to manage. This will all be closed up. It'll all be closed up like that. Open up storage. And on storage, you go disk management. Boom. This is where we're going to do what we need to do. All right. This is the system. This is the system disk drive, hard drive rather. And you see it's partitioned. And it's already partitioned by Open Labs because they put a... Um, a system restore partition on here in case you ever have problems so that's why this drive is divided into two but down here remember we saw location one I mean location zero and location one that's how you're gonna know what the situation is now I, I already went ahead and I partitioned and named and did all of that stuff with mine but yours isn't gonna look like this yours you'll see that there's a disk in location one but all the information won't be filled in so all you have to do just click right here and you get those um, uh, diagonal lines you right click and you come here and you can format and you can name it and you can set up your uh, you pick the letter for the drive path okay so after you do that it might take a minute because it's a terabyte so that's that's a lot of data but after you do that you close that joint out and then when you go to my computer I happen to name it audio drive and I selected E. So, because my disk drive came up as D, my optical. So I just picked the next letter. You could pick whatever you want. So, that's the situation. And that's all you gotta do. Now, you know what else? I'm gonna look out for y'all. I'm gonna show you something else, a little, a little secret thing that I just found. I want y'all to check this out. See, it's so new, I ain't even authorized it yet. All right, let that load up. It's called Beat Thing Virtual. It's kind of crazy. It's real cheap, and you don't need to check it out. Um, 
It's at uh, BeatKings.com. And Kings, it's not Kings, K-I-N-G-S. It's Kangs. It's K-A-N-G-Z. All right? It's a, it's a Z, not an S. So check that out. The sounds are crazy. I think you'll enjoy it. So I hope this helps somebody out. If anybody had an issue, I hope this, you know, makes it simpler for you. If not, open labs, call them up, tech support, and they'll take care of you. All right, y'all. Peace.